In this video, I'm going to talk about shingles. Shingles is a viral infection that causes a painful rash, and although shingles can occur anywhere on your body, it most often appears as a single stripe of blisters that wraps around either the left or the right side of your torso. It is uncommon in children, and it is caused by the varicella zoster virus, which is the same virus that causes chicken pox. It is caused by the reactivation of latent varicella zoster virus, VZV, causing a vesicular eruption in the dermatomal distribution of the sensory nerves. And this VZV is located at dorsal root and or at the cranial nerve ganglions. So this picture over here shows the vesicular rash seen in shingles. For clinical features, there is often dermatomal pain at the site of the preceding rashes for 2-3 to three days and there is vesicular eruption in the distribution of the sensory nerves, which is usually unilateral. The commonest site is at the thoracic region, and it is often associated with the cranial nerve 5 and cranial nerve 7, which is also seen in Ramsey-Hunt syndrome. For treatment, you can give antiviral therapy, for example, acyclovir, velociclovir, or femciclovir. There are some complications of shingles, which are neuralgic pain, but it is rare in childhood. Neuralgic pain is when there is a stabbing, burning, and often severe pain due to the irritated or damaged nerve. And these shingles can also disseminate to cause severe disease in the immunocompromised people. It can cause aseptic meningitis and also herpes zoster ophthalmicus, which is threatening to lose the sight. That's all for my video. Thank you.